Hello everyone, it's Patty. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'll be sharing with you my setup of the gorgeous B6 Traveler notebook that comes with the September sub box from Simply Gilded. Uh, the theme of the month is Fancy Fit and the box is actually still available on the website if you would like to subscribe and uh, you will be getting this beautiful Traveler notebook with your box uh, aside from all the other goodies that are included, which are a ton. Now, I'll be sharing with you everything that I have used, so if you want to replicate this look, this setup, you can definitely do so. In the meantime, again, this is vegan leather. It's gorgeous. It has a soft pink color with these rose gold lines, and rose gold is super rich and warm. It's perfect for the fall. I love the scalloped edge and the beautiful heart closure over here. And before I open it up, uh, let me show you exactly what I have used. Now, um, this, uh, the the fancy fit box comes with acetate and vellums and a gorgeous card but i really have been wanting to use um papers and not papers but a trim the insert and some accessories from the april box which was the first class box and so i really thought that this would lend itself to it so beautifully and i just felt like i wanted to use that box so instead of using papers from this particular box i've used some from the older box so this is what is left of the <laughs> first class box which i'm so glad i kept because as you can tell i basically tore it apart and then i've also used some of these puffy stickers from the planner society then i have used a couple of papers um, this one i used a couple of papers from the cosmopolitan paper crafting kit from hobby lobby now this is old i think i bought it on sale a year or two ago and it was two dollars but as you can tell it's got all this marble all this soft pink so in case you have it i used that those papers and then i've also used a couple of papers from this uh, DCW uh, V uh, Samantha Rose uh, paper pack. So um, I have used, uh, let me see, I think I used, uh, yes, this paper here, and uh, I may have used a marble paper as well, yes. So those are the ones. So basically anything rose gold, I went for it. But let me show you how it looks on the inside now here we are and by the way i just love it this is so soft so butter so beautiful this is the gorgeous pen that comes with the kit perfect match now on this side there is a little flap and uh, to decorate it because this is mainly decoration i've used an older uh, sticky note um, from uh, simply gilded i put one of the simply gilded paper clips as well as this one is also uh, from simply actually i'm not sure about this one i'm staying correct i don't think this is simply gilded but this one is definitely from simply gilded from an older box uh, uh, is a rose gold I put a little uh, little flag little thing there and then here I made a little washi cards using this acetate from the planner society that I have for a while and this is the um, kind of I created my own concoction you know my own mix of uh, washi tapes to create uh, the washi dashboard all in rose gold and then back here I have these beautiful heart seals that came with the first class box and then on top here and said I have uh, dug out my little calendar uh, this calendar um, is for came in the uh, December or January box uh, so it, you know it came with all the little hearts and they're all tied together so I have taken out October November and December they're in rose gold so they're beautiful and then I'm holding them together with a little paper clip from one creative bee and I just have it over here just like so because I just like how it peeks out now here is the first uh, uh, of the three uh, sections and as always I have used three uh, separate inserts and this is the gorgeous gorgeous vellum that comes in the box it has this embossed design in a chevron I don't think you can really see it here but it's a beautiful embossed chevron um, design in rose gold foiling and on top here I have used this uh, um, bow decal from the fox and pip it's not exactly the same rose gold but close enough and then here is my first dashboard as you can tell you'll recognize it if you subscribe but this is from the box from the first class box 
I just cut it out. I have trimmed the top here a little bit to make it fit. And then I have used this uh, paper, which is like a, a marble paper uh, that uh, I had. And I really went with this color scheme. Basically, I wanted to have rose gold. I wanted to have, um, you know, the the soft pinks, etc. But I was inspired by the washi tape that Irene had in the box, which is this beautiful marble with uh, rose gold bows and so I just thought I would try to tie in those colors and kind of like concentrate the design around those uh, um, in that theme so here it is it's very simple but I, I try to keep it kind of more like a you know not sophisticated but like you just like a simpler look not too much fuss not too too many accessories and here on the side I have these um, uh, glitter edges from the planner society they're uh, similar pink with little white dots and then now this paper was just one-sided so on the back on the inside here i basically uh, glued on this paper which is a gorgeous soft um you know um, pink with the rose gold that came in the samantha rose kit i showed you and here is my first insert which i have started to decorate a little bit uh, this is an insert that is a pre-printed insert from any plans plain printable um, these are sold on um, uh, Happy Scrappy. So Sam prints these in the beautiful paper. So they are not dated, they are, but they are timed. And this is my favorite setup. And so this time, instead of printing my own insert, I had these. They're the perfect size. And so I just added the little dates. I used the little hearts that you get on, um, you know, with the, the kit from uh, Simply Gilded. And so I've just used a variety. I've used the, the stickers from the uh, September box. I've used also those from the August box and uh, um, just, you know, started to decorate it, but, you know, I haven't written anything in yet. So in the back here, I have, again, the, the marble paper and then this beautiful sticky note, which is also from Simply Gilda, and it has the, the rose gold around it, so it was a perfect match. Here's the back of uh, the vellum and i have the sticker that says adventure because you know the theme of the april the april box was first class however you know i'm kind of like not interpreting it um, this is going to be my plan is not for travel related but you know travel is, is more inspirational for you know travel since we can't really travel that far yet but um this sticker came in the little um cosmopolitan paper craft, paper crafting pack that i showed you earlier now here is the uh, washi dashboard, which I absolutely love. I have combined some of the washi from August, like the little houses here, with washi from um, the September box. And then this one is a little washi that I've had uh, for a long time at home. And then is a, um, a bow seal, which I love to use on my washi um, dashboards. And then here is the gorgeous insert which is, you know, sheer perfection because it's so beautiful. And uh, in the band, clearly I didn't want to attach anything to it. I didn't want to ruin the design. I'm just leaving it as is. And then here's the back of uh, the washi uh, dashboard with another little uh, bow decals, bow seal. And then here is a vellum that I have found on Amazon actually it comes in a pack of 24 and it's eight dollars which is a little steep but I could not find um, marble vellum at Hobby Lobby and Michaels and so I just bought it on uh, on Amazon and then I put some of the puffy stickers from the planner society and then the same little glitter edger now this instead is another acetate in rose gold uh, from the planner society with this love decal from uh, Virgo in paper and then uh, here, here's my last uh, little uh, insert. So very simple setup, very basic, but that's all I need, honestly. And this is gonna be a meal planner and it's also uh, an insert from Any Plants Printables, love her inserts. And the paper I, I used here is from that uh, Cosmopolitan Paper Crafting Kit. It has all this little rose gold accent. It has a little bit of gray and pink. So I thought it would be a perfect match. It's not necessarily marble, but it's close enough. And this is the beautiful card that came in the April box which I've trimmed down and I backed it with um, a rose gold uh, uh, little uh, paper and then little eyelets on the corner and actually I just love this it's just very simple but it's just you know gorgeous I mean I, I love it 
and in the back here because the paper again was single-sided just like the other one I have used this other paper from uh, um, the Cosmopolitan paper crafting kit and actually now that I think about it yeah the paper crafting kit came with the marble paper yes so that's where um, this paper also uh, also came from so that that's a cute little kit I mean it was two dollars can you imagine I mean it was what a bargain and uh, um, in the back here I have used this uh, a little uh, pocket um, which I think it's from the Planner Society, uh, don't, don't quote me, and then uh, here inside here I have two sheets of the date stickers from Simply Gilded, this one came um, in the box this month, then another cute little clip from Simply Gilded, a little soft uh, pink bow from Hobby Lobby, and then this is a sticker that came in the same Cosmopolitan paper crafting kit. Then here is the um, the back of the acetate with this bow decal from Marg, once more with love. And then here is the vellum, um, the, the um, marble vellum, and another sticker, puffy sticker from the Planner Society. Now, in the back here, I've added, like I always, you know, I often do, add a little pouch if I can. So this is a little pouch that came in a box earlier. Normally, I would just make a little hole here and here, and then run an elastic and then attach it, but I really didn't want to ruin it. And so basically, you can just, you know, slip it like this just because of the way that it is designed. It actually fits perfectly in there. So you can store extra stickers, you can store anything, receipts if you're using it as a wallet or whatever, but it just works perfectly in it. So this is it guys. I think it was a, a very quick flip through and uh, a very quick setup as well but um, I think I mentioned everything I used but if I forgot something and if you have any questions just send me a DM at planning fancy on Instagram and I reply to all the ends right away so I hope you liked it and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week bye bye